So we have the battery connected up, and it's reading zero volts. Now, I know it's not shorted out, because a shorted out battery, like one of these, it just, whenever you, whenever you turn up the voltage, it would just let all the amperage while not having any voltage to. Whereas with these, what we're going to do is we're going to turn down the current, so it'll limit the current to almost nothing. And we'll bring up the voltage. It's like 10 milliamps of current. See the voltage is going up? It's slowly going up. It's taking a charge. We have to charge it at an, at an extremely low current, otherwise it'll short the cell out. Which, first of all, if you short out a cell, you lose the cell. And second of all, all the energy that it has stored into it will then turn into heat and it could catch on fire. So that's not good either. I right, see the voltage is already going up slightly. I'll increase it to 15 milliamps. I'll let it sit until it gets to 1.5 volts. Now it's at 1.5 volts, so I'll bring the current up a little bit more because it can handle it now. We're at 70 milliamps. So now that it's a little bit over 2.2 volts, I'm gonna bring up the volt and the amperage to my, maybe 400 milliamps of current. Start charging a little bit faster, you know. And now that it's high enough, I'm just charging with with about pretty much an amp of current, and it's it's pretty much stable now, so you don't have to worry about it too much. Although there is like a one in, one in 10,000 chance that it will short out, but most problem of a short of battery shorting out is you mishandling them. Now, unfortunately, there's one thing I have to say about this, though. This cell will have half or even less of its original capacity. This cell, which has been up to voltage for its entire life, will most likely have 2.1 amp hours of capacity. This cell will probably have 1 amp hour or less. That's not to say it's not useless. It's All right, that's not to say it's useless. It's very useful. I built my, my first battery pack out of entirely under-voltage cells. All the cells in my first battery pack were under one volt, and they were they were low capacity. But they was but the battery pack only cost me eighty dollars, and it still got me twenty miles on a charge, or twenty to thirty miles on a charge. And it, I'm still using it today. I've put about three hundred miles on it. So, don't throw these away. They're they're still useful. Just don't charge them at high amperage, otherwise that'll short them out and you make them useless. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video, and thanks for watching. See ya.